Alrighty, g'day guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good to see you in chat already. Thank you for coming. This is the earliest that I've been in a very long time. <laughs> um, I tried to get a good sleep yesterday. I went to bed at like 11.30 and um, you know how it's like, it's really hard to go to sleep when you sleep in for a long time the day before. So I, I got out of bed at like midday yesterday. So then trying to go to bed at 1130, it was always going to be tough, but, um, I gave it a shot. I was listening to my audio book for a while to kind of get me into the sleepy mood and yeah, it was, it was, it was a bit difficult. <laughs> I don't remember when I actually fell asleep. I, I was just like tossing and turning for a while and then I was like, you know what? I'm not sleeping. Let me look at my phone for a bit. And that always makes me sleepy. So I did that for a while. Then I fell asleep. Apparently I slept well enough because I got up on time and I feel all right. So I will take that as a win. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here. Yeah, how are you guys? How has the week been treating you? I was going to stream yesterday, but I don't know. This week, this week has had weird vibes. Just have not really felt like doing much at all for some reason. So, I don't know. I wasn't really in the mood, but I thought since I actually have a free day tomorrow, Unusually, I'm always, always busy on Saturday, usually Sunday too, but yeah, I have a free Saturday morning, so I might stream then instead, might play some Stardew or something for a bit of a laugh, should be a nice chill stream. Been playing a little bit in my spare time for those of you who've been kind of paying attention to my, or who did pay attention to my old series over here on Twitch. But yeah, I've been continuing that a little bit. Doing a few of the, the challenges for Mr. Chi. Fun. Got a, a second ostrich. <laughs> I haven't given them any, any different names though. Stormy Weather Link expired yesterday. Ah, oh, did it? Uh, really? That's quick. Because I'm pretty sure some of the other links still work that were from older, from longer ago. Well, I'll, I'll have to test it out. It was only a week. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. Yeah, I don't have too much planned today just gonna do a bit of building um i've sketched out some stuff for me to build in my spreadsheet so i'm gonna get on that hopefully it will be a bit of a chill stream you know we'll just hang out have a chat It'll be fun oh what let me get in first come on what is this Hello guys, um, I should jump in the voice chat, I guess. Oop, not connecting. <laughs> okay, just you two. Damn it, it's not connecting. I'll join it later in like a couple minutes. Um, I need a thermal stone. But yeah, today I was thinking of... I added the little pig village last time. Uh, we did the grass area before that. And now, I, I think I have enough marble to replace some of these turfs with marble. I think one or two of them will marble. And I was going to extend out over here... And maybe put some farmland. I think that'd be nice. 
I, I really do need a thermal stone though. Okay, leave that there. Let me put all my food back. Please. <laughs> a bird. Gotta put him in the salt box. I don't think he would have liked that very much. Got a Krampus act for the first time 32 minutes ago. Wow, congrats. Well done. I hope you enjoy the space. <laughs> oh, my nose is very runny today. Not good. I better not be getting sick again. I was sick like two weeks ago. So annoying. Do you guys get sick often? I... Honestly, the last 10 years, I've been getting sick like once every two or three years. <laughs> it's been pretty, pretty good for me. Why lag it? Come on. Um, I'll make some eggs. I may end up needing some more food. Ah, it's pigs. I was thinking of potentially playing on my solo world. Maybe I might do that next week. Um, I'm kind of interested at seeing how I go with fighting that boss. I don't know. Could be could be a bit of fun, but it would take a bit of setting up too. So yeah, that could be a project for next week. But for now, we we'll just keep going in here. his friend not food fish are friends not food <laughs> good show really I have a bunch of turf that I could use no one's gonna get upset me burning savannah turf right It's fine. Not a single tear will be shed. Um, so I probably... Yeah, you guys got heaps. It's fine. I've probably got just a, about as much as well. Is it Friday? It is Friday for me. Yes. It is Friday at 9.20 a.m. So, yes. Getting deep into Friday now. How much rocky turf do I have? Okay. Uh, yeah, that's a fair bit to work with. You can do some things with that. I left the server. Yeah, I couldn't join. For some reason, something internet related. I'll try again in a couple minutes. Um, yeah, so I'm going to dig out from the path here. Should be good. I should get a third screen. I think I should turn this off too. Badly. I I think the server it's I don't know, it says it's been it's performing alright, but it hasn't felt that good this time for whatever reason. Maybe it just needs like a really proper reset next time we start the server, the world. Oh, I need a pitchfork, of course. See, look at that. What is that? Ugh. Awful. If it's really bad, I will just go in my solo world. Because it's not fun playing like that. Hey, Verdu, how you doing? Pitchfork. Uh, 2%? <laughs> That's not going to get a whole lot done. This is like the one thing that I need flint for. Making pitchforks. That's it. Such a relaxing voice. Thank you, scary jokes. I appreciate that. Can I clean the flint? 
I think I can. I think I can. Um, I need to find that command though. I don't know if you need the command anymore, actually. Let me do a, a save. Just to... Just to check. Nida as well, okay. So if this doesn't work, I'll roll back. <laughs> so, clean up. Brilliant. Okay, yeah, it seemed to work. And you wanted Nida as well. Nida. Good. Alrighty. Hopefully that worked. Actually, I can just put one on the floor. Oh. No, I didn't do anything. <laughs> okay. You do need the command. Dad. I should make like a text file and just paste all these commands that I I don't remember. Um Where is it? It's very long. It's like three lines long. There you go. Okay. Hey. C. Clean up. Clean up. That's not how you spell. Clean up. Flinch. There you go. Now it works. Awesome. And I'll jump in the voice chat. And that works too. Very nice. G'day, coconut. Good to see you. And what was the other one? Nida. I'll do Nida as well. Okay. I don't know how much that will help, but it's better than nothing. Rotten egg. Oh yeah, we're going to do the whole thing. Grotto pull big. That's not it. <laughs> Rotten egg. Boiled food, yada yada, spoiled fish, spoiled food, and toots, <laughs> and tooth. There you go. It's all right. I'm just, I'm just kidding. Can you? G'day, the Jen Smith. Hope you're having a good one. All right, that's that. We got golden host before golden pitchfork. I know, what is the deal with that? They're just trolling me. Thank you, Cassia, for these seven months. Mamma mia, seven months. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing well. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's go. I'll have to dig up Mr. Bunny, I think. And there it goes. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go, a little bit down here. I don't know what I'll do in this, this negative space here. I haven't quite decided, but yeah. If you guys have any suggestions, Narcoleptic Frog, thank you very much for that prime sub. Welcome into the gang, the potato squad. <laughs> Hope you enjoy the emotes and the, the cute little sub badges as well. Thank you for the support. G'day kites. Yes, I'm awake. I know, I'm surprised too. <laughs> Normally keep you guys waiting like another half hour or so. What's going on? Is it three? That will go another one. And then here... 
This is going to be where the farms will be built. Oh, what's up with claws? Is claws around? It is winter. How many was that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Alright. Eight. Nine. There you go. Whoops. Um, why is it called Potato Squad? I, I don't, it's not really called anything. I just like potatoes. And the sub badges are potatoes, so. I'll just make a little fire. I can't be bothered going back, it's too far. <laughs> Do I like death metal? Not really, no. <laughs> I don't dislike it, I just, it's not really my jam. The closest that I, my music taste gets to death metal would be like Linkin Park, Breaking Benjamin, that kind of thing. That's about as far as I go. So that's that. And I can put a little lip on the end. Oh, I don't have my... I a hat. I think I put that away. Crazy time of year for you. Is it, is it exam time? Or just very busy in general? I seem to remember a few people having exams around this time. I know my sister is studying and she's super busy at the moment. And here... How did I do this? One, two, three, four on the fifth one. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And we go five down. Easy. All right, so yeah, that's going to be my, my main little area there. Good Crab King, got the tribute. Uh, four Volt Goat Jelly, ten, ten Dolosite Crowns, damn. Yes, I think you're prepared enough. <laughs> I think you will be fine. Done with exams. Probably failed though. Oh man. Although sometimes it's when I feel like I've failed that I end up doing well. And it, when I think I've done really well, then I'm disappointed. So hopefully it's something like that for you. I, why do I not have a furnace? What is wrong with me? Strange. Yeah, I do not miss having exams. Oh man, that shit was so stressful. <laughs> Honestly, is there not a better way to learn? Is there a better way than exams? What was that arena? Okay. <laughs> I get it. I'll come. You guys are waiting for me, huh? I'll just leave this stuff here. I'm slow, okay? I think I'll be okay like that. Yeah. But another four years, damn. Well, I mean, everyone has to do their time. And when it's over, it's over. You won't have to do it again, so. You know, from high school to when I finished uni, there was... What the heck is this? Joe. Okay. Um, yeah, from high school to when I finished uni was like 12 years of studying and, and exams, so... 
It ain't great. But you get through it, and then you can enjoy not having to worry about that stuff. Thank you for the follow, Wild Apples and Space Meatball. Appreciate it. How are you guys doing? Uh, I think I have enough of those. Alright, I'm almost there guys, sorry. Hello. <laughs> Alright, let's go, yeah. <laughs> oh, what? Ah. Uh. He got stuck on the sack. Does he still get hurt when he when he ducks down like that? I wonder. Ah, uh, just whatever. crown, I don't think it works anymore. What the fuck? Need more sanity for it to work. Okay. Awkward timing. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Close one. Hey. <laughs> Hell yeah. Too good. Never stood a chance. Had an exam today. It was absolute pain, but I think I did very well. Awesome. Congrats. And as soon as the fight is done, now my my crown turns on. <laughs> Just when I need it. Alright, shall we open up this bad boy? Oh, okay. Fucking hell. Ooh! Uh, steel wool. <laughs> hey! 
Um, we've all got one. <laughs> what do we do with it? <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Do we have like a place at... Put it in the void! No. Do we have a place at Combase that just keeps the spare ones? <laughs> I mean, it used to be like when you join the server, you just instantly get bundling wrap blueprint, you know, you get uh, bone armor and all that stuff. Now you, you just get a Krampus sack straight out of the gates. Uh, does anyone want the steel wool? The scales? No. Pass. Okay. Cool. Whoa. <laughs> uh, don't mind me. Just looking. <laughs> Just looking. Yeah, the crown is from the new boss when you kill the champion. It's a pretty decent drop. As you can see, it made the fight go a lot quicker. Am I going the right way? Yeah. You get those uh, minor gestalts that, that help you with the fight. That's that's probably the best thing. You also get light and you get uh, sanity, passive sanity gain as well. But I think the gestalts are the best bit, to be honest. Twigs? Twigs? I don't know what this is. Hmm. I have an idea who made it. <laughs> Should dismantle it. Teach him a lesson. Don't build shit near my base. some more of this. Not that one. No. No. There we go. Much better. Ah, we gotta eat. G'day Palmer, how you doing? Thank you, Kay. I can totally see you doing that. Maybe I will go with a meaty stew. Do I have to open my bundle again? Am I out of food? Yeah, okay. Yeah, if you struggle with the bosses that were in the game already, then this one is going to be pretty too difficult. Jesus. Another bad thing about the crown, it doesn't have any insulation, so you get cold pretty quickly wearing it in winter. Unfortunate, but that is how it is. Um, this keeps me warm. I don't need to wear the crown when I'm not fighting, so... That one. Yeah. Gales. I should make a furnace. Let me make one. It's just one scale, isn't it? And... 
It's like charcoal. Some charcoal and red gems. Where are my red gems? Ah. Red gems. Okay. Let me go with... I'll go with this one. It's pretty nice. Um, just chuck it in the kitchen for now. Yeah. And while it's winter, I'll just get my other thermal stone and leave it next to here so I can switch them really easily. I like it. Um, I assume you guys didn't want the bundling wrap either, because I, I took that. <laughs> yeah, we've all got heaps at this stage. Alright guys. <laughs> Honestly, I'm surprised you don't have more. I assume that's just what you have on your person. I think I have more than that. That goes away. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I need to build more glow caps too. Because it's... Uh, I need one in the middle. That would be helpful. Pretty dark. My base is dark. I need some light. So I can see... I think I may be missing bone shards. Need bone shards for the bucket of poop. Hmm. Well, actually, let's check that I have shroom skin first. Because that is kind of important. I think I do. I have one. Uh. I don't think I have the- I don't have a knapsack. Who has a knapsack blueprint that can make me a knapsack? You do? Okay. It's uh, it's one canary and one shroom skin, right? Or oh, you just want to fight Toad. <laughs> All right, fine. <laughs> I mean, winter, it would be a good time because Toad would be wet, right? So, it makes sense. <laughs> it would just be the three of us. Hmm. Might need some sanity food to keep the crown from deteriorating a bit. Alright, yeah, if you guys want to, I'm down. In the next couple days, we have jelly. Alrighty. <laughs> yeah, we should be fine, just us three, right? Um, where's my logs? Hey, Soggy. How are you doing? Put up some gears. Yeah, I've got plenty of gears that I could take. I kind of like fighting toadstool because unless you know you mess up the the final stage of the fight or unless you get depth worms or something you don't really take much damage you can normally block it with the bone armor so 
I don't normally need much in terms of healing food. I'm just going to stand here while I craft. I haven't played Grounded in a long time, actually, Soggy. I thought about it the other day. It might be fun to come back to it. I mean, even when I did play it, I didn't play a whole lot, so... Yeah, okay. Sounds good to me. Oh, you got a canary already. Awesome. You guys are on top of things. Life is so easy playing on, on the dedicated server. I never need to really worry about setting up stuff. It's just always ready whenever I need it. <laughs> Want to fight a boss? All the prep work has been done, you know? Always. Um, I think I will. Was this my food? I think this was my food. Food up top. God damn it. <laughs> How do I keep doing this? How do I get it wrong every time? Mm. I don't think I need one either. My brain. She no work. No work. Uh, that can go in salt box, I think. Yeah, it sounds like a mod that would be good, Sticky. I think there was a mod that does that, but it's a server mod. I know Insight does that. I don't know if there's a client mod that does the same thing. But I should remember. <laughs> I'm just disappointed that I can't remember. You have experience plays? Yes. Uh, I think that pretty much says it all. <laughs> How many hours? I just passed 1700 hours yesterday. Playing the egg game. <laughs> so, uh, I've got a lot, but I've also, I probably have about half as much as these guys do. Hat game. The hat game is pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah, I do like it. I don't know if it's better than that game, but good game. Okay. Um, so we'll do that the day after. I'm going to get a, another tissue because my nose is still annoying me. I'll be back in a second. Alright, I'm back. Sucks that I have to log out, but... I probably didn't need to, but better to be safe than sorry. Have you played everything from Clay? Um... I haven't played... 
Chank, and I haven't played Eats. Like, those are very early, early games, though. So. Don't know if they count. Oh, where the pains? Where are the pains? I think I left mine at Fuel Weaver. Good day, little noob. How you doing? Alright, let's see what I got. Let's go with this. Take that. Actually, I'll take this one. Could be a good chance to use that. Uh, I don't think I'll need that. Good evening. Good evening, Moss. Thank you very much for the three month resub. How are you doing? I should be fine. These gears will be plenty, I think. They'll also get my sanity back up should I need it. Um, I can make dark swords. Yeah, I think I'm pretty good. Leave the hat. I'll leave this hat too. Yeah, thank you for the support, Moss. Much appreciated. Oh, it's daytime. Jesus. How's the stream so far? It's going well. Yeah, it's going well. It's uh, going to... Hoping to be a chill stream today. Every time I say that, we just fight like every single boss in the game. <laughs> but... It should be fine. Yeah, I'm looking at you, Kanoon. <laughs> but yeah, tomorrow we're going to fight Toadstool, and after that, after that we should, I'll just do a bit more building. See, I, I've planned out a bit of an area here. Want to grow some crops? I, I don't think I've grown anything in this server. It'll be fun. It'll be a good way to get some food that's not meat as well. I've been... A house? No. It's that pig. I've been eating just a, a meat-based diet this whole time. It, uh, it can't be good for my circuits, you know? Wish they updated Don't Starve. Yeah, that game... It's, uh, it's pretty much done. Thank you, Drevero, for the follow. G'day. Good to see ya. I think the thing that makes me very sad about Don't Starve recently is with the drops. You used to be able to get drops from watching people stream single player Don't Starve as well. And a lot of people didn't know that. And um, so they would avoid watching streams of single player Don't Starve. But you'd still get some people that would stream it. But now you can't even earn the drops on single play Don't Starve anymore. And if you search up that category, there's just no one. On on Twitch, it's just dead. Just nothing there. It, it's very sad. Okay. Yikes. Wag stuff. Yeah, I mean, I, I like Don't Starve for what it is. I enjoy it. I like all the stuff. It's just, it's got so much stuff in it, you know? The city, all the, the little shops and the houses. This is I mean this is just Hamlet. The bosses are kinda quirky and fun. Um Is there a furnace here? Yeah. The characters, the worlds, the turfs, the things you can build. 
and then you know you go to shipwrecked you got the water the water feels much more vibrant and alive compared to the water in dst and when it comes to base building i mean you could almost make a better base in in single play than you can in in multiplayer because there's just a lot of stuff They have to bring Hamlet to DST? I don't think they will. I don't think they will. I'd be very surprised if they did. Oh, he's over there. Okay. There are mods. But I think that's as far as it will go. As close as it will come. If they did that, then why would anyone buy Hamlet, you know? <laughs> I think the mistake that they made was making the two separate games. They should have just been the same game. So when, you know, instead of having to update DST and update single player separately, like, for a long time, single player didn't even have beefalo taming. That's a recent thing. Um, but yeah, instead of having to do it like that, they could have just updated them both at the same time. Make there be a couple of DLCs if you want to play on your own in Don't Starve. And you can play together if you feel like. That would have been ideal. I'm not sure why they, why they did it that way. Maybe the coding for single player was so suboptimal that they thought they could do it better by just starting afresh but yeah i don't know i'm not a programmer i'm not a, a game developer i don't know why they chose to do it that way but it, it didn't make that much sense to me Some of the bosses wouldn't work. Well, definitely, yeah. I mean, if you... Playing Don't Starve with other people, like single play Don't Starve with other people would just be way too easy. The bosses in single play Don't Starve, besides maybe a couple in Hamlet, are incredibly easy. <laughs> For starters, they have half the health, at least. Dragonfly has like 10 times less health. I think in Shipwrecked, the boss with the most health has like 1500, <laughs> which is what? That's like how much health a tree guard has. It's, it's crazy. Not to mention his coffee. You have um, Cutlass, which is a dark sword that does no sanity drain. Yeah. Are we going to wait till it stops raining or does it matter? We wait for Joe. Oh, Joe's coming. All right. I mean, how long is it going to stay like that? Does it stay like that for oh, a few minutes? Okay. Yeah, there you go. All the bosses in Hamlet are easy. Yeah. Well, especially if you have good items. Like if you have coffee, every boss is easy. Hello, Joe. I saw the the neighbor that you've made for me. I assume it was you. <laughs> yes, it was. <laughs> Ooh, thank you. That's why you like Wormwood? Well, I mean... Rain stop. Yeah, perfect, isn't it? 
Does that mean that you'd like Wolfgang for the same reason? We're fighting Toad. Come on down, Joe. Quick. <laughs> you might miss it. I think it makes sense, Moss, when you think about it, because you, they used canaries in the mines to tell if the mine is safe. So they'll s send a canary down or something, and if it if it comes back, then the mine is safe or something. You know, canary in the coal mine. So that's why they use it. don't really like his buffs I I mean ooh, okay we're not waiting for Joe anymore it seems <laughs> let me chug that down <laughs> so I'm gonna get hit with this poison cloud every time because you guys just hang back right Yeah. <laughs> the only boss that doesn't directly attack you. I guess you could say that. You could say that about um, Antlion as well. It doesn't directly attack you. I should make a... Is there a teleporter? Yes! Make myself an axe, huh? Ooh! I've been getting a lot of spiffy items lately. Stayed in there. Hey, there's Joe. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, little noob. Still gets me. Oh, we're up to phase two. <sighs> Stop it. <laughs> Leave me alone. Big frog. <sighs> One hit. Hey, there we go. I love that. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Doing so much damage to him. Oh, boy. Okay. Did he just skip a phase? Or did we attack him that much that he's doing a stumpy now? <laughs> boing boing Wow <laughs> What? <laughs> Damn 
That was 99,000 health. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Thank you, Helizio, for the follow. Get a join at a good time. Yeah, I mean, we all have end game loot, so. Alright, um. Wait. Damn it, Joe, come on. <laughs> Alright, you roll. I swear, if you win this, this is the whole reason. Uh, we fought Toad's Tool, so I could get a knapsack. Oh, okay, good. Ooh. <laughs> I shouldn't have been worried. I mean, you, you have terrible rolls. <laughs> you need a red hat. I think I have all the hats, so... I won't compete with you for that one. Do I have a glow cap as well? I think I have a glow cap. Yeah, I don't have the other one. That was ridiculously easy. I'm gonna leave this here. He made the- wait, did he actually age the crown spores? Wow. That's interesting. I didn't realize that. <laughs> so what, you gotta take your spores out before you fight so he doesn't make them decay. Oh, you lost two! Ooh! Jeez, okay. I actually should get some spores myself. And winter is not a bad time because they'll be the, the blue ones, right? Hmm. Alrighty. Green is superior. Green is spring. Maybe I'll get some blue and some green. Hmm. Think about it. Well, I can't get green now, so... The Sims, yes! <laughs> it is too! Well, I mean, if it's going to be realistic, then I should get red ones. <laughs> Yeah, we have been Phil Weaver just uh, a few times, yeah. I mean, I've got the bone armor. Come on, I've got bone armor on me. Of course we've beaten him. How many times do you reckon we've beaten him? 20? In this server? Maybe even more. Three times? <laughs> Yeah, I'll come back with a, a bug net. So I'm getting distracted. Oh well. No, I should actually do the bug net first because when winter goes away, it ain't coming back. Hey, Allison. Is it just me or do you wake up really early these days? I don't remember you joining the stream so early. Way back when. It's 8 a.m. Okay. That's not so bad. This time anyway. Hello, Miffle. How have you been? Five PM. Five PM is good. Five PM. Five PM. Five PM. Is that uh, Central? Central time.
Good night, Cassia. Thanks for stopping by and for the, the sub before as well. Hope you have a good rest. Moved to a new place recently. Awesome! That's so cool! Are you still studying, Miffle? Okay. Oh, I didn't even... I'm sorry guys, I didn't share the shroom skin. Did anyone want some? I just took it all and was like, yep. Seems good to me. <laughs> Do you guys need any? I, I've i got the knapsack blueprint, so... You do need? Okay. Um, how many of us? There were four of us. So... Um, I guess we roll for the spare one. And then I'll come and give you guys one each. My bad. <laughs> oh, no, that's what I get. Oh, <laughs> Joe, come on. <laughs> I'll give you one, Joe. What is the wall skin? Uh, does this wall skin? This is... Ancient Stone Wall. It was a, a limited time... skin that you could get for logging in around when the archive update came out. I don't think you can get it anymore, which is kind of sad. It was really good. I I hope that they bring it back in some capacity. Maybe they'll they'll add it as a, a drop that you can get from the clay rewards page, because there are some really good ones that you can't get anymore. I think did they did they let you get the claws cap again? Because that one is is one of my favorite skins as well that a lot of people missed out on. What does shroom skin do? Um, it's the main ingredient, well, one of the main ingredients in the glow caps and, um, mush lights. That's, that's the main thing that people get it for. It sits off the head slightly. That's fine. It's, it's a beautiful skin. It can sit wherever it likes. Alright, where are you guys at? You have a chest for shroom skin? Can I just leave it in there? <laughs> I don't want to run around and find you all. Uh, where is it? You guys have way too many chests. Oh, there it is. Alright, I will put four in there. So there are now seven. You guys get one each and Cobra gets two. Wait, is there a... Oh, the wireless is still there. Nice. That's the wrong way. I'm slowly starting to learn my way around this place. Take that egg, thank you. Very expensive. It is very expensive. That's why you get the knapsack. So then you can duplicate it. Twenty six ninety one. So someone, someone do three. No, do twenty six ninety one divided by three hundred and seventy. <laughs> Just off the top of your head. <laughs> uh, it'd be it'd be like almost. No, it's not seven, is it? No, no, yeah. Hmm? No, no. 7.2, okay. Wait, what is it as a percentage? To do 370 divided by 2691. Did I eat all my food? Oh, what?
Goes too quick. I don't even need to use that. Thirteen point seven. Wow. <laughs> Thirteen point seven. So that's how much of this world I've played. Yikes. Cobra's played more than 50%. Thank you, Jen Smith. Have a good night. And good morning, Vu. <laughs> One leaves, another joins. Okay, I said I was going to go back into the caves and get some spores while it's still... Well, it's still winter. We got four days left. How many? I have one, two. Do I even want to put them in there? Eh, I don't know. I might just get five. See, can you even bundle them up? Because if you do, then when you unbundle them, they just go on the floor. So you can't really bundle them. Hmm. I just, might just make one. Yeah, we killed Claws uh, a few days before we did Toad. We may get a second round of it though. I don't remember how long it would take to respawn with the setting as it is in this world. Didn't end up using that. Okay. Uh, might want to take my my warm hat again. It doesn't sit off to the side. It's just the the little lock thing is on slightly on one side. The hat sits perfectly well. What do glow caps do? They just provide light. They provide light. And depending on what you put in them, they can give off a bit of color too. If you put in the crown shards, they even last permanently. They last forever. Spores last 30 days, I think, in glow caps. Something like that. We have a mod that everything lasts forever because it's a dedicated world and it sucks, you, you know, you put one in and then you come back after a bit of a break and it's expired, so everything just lasts forever in this world. Good night, Kay. Yeah, it was good to see you for a bit. Have a good day at work. Hey, Shizo. Shizo? Shizo? I'm doing well, thank you. Thank you for asking. Let me know if I mispronounce your name, guys, because I don't know. I would much rather you tell me so then I can get it right. <laughs> Unless you don't care. Can you fight the chess pieces? I mean, I can. I don't, when is the, the date for it? Because we've changed the moon cycle. 93 tomorrow. Hmm. So I need it's all the way over there. That's annoying. Maybe I should have gone down a different one. Maybe we'll try a different one. Aren't they supposed to come out of these things? Or is it only when you collect them? I'm not sure. If 
from ah oh, from the hat. Yeah, that's a good idea. Ah oh, no, these weren't made with spores. If you make them with the spores, then you can. Some spores might come out of them. That's what I was thinking. I can make that. So. In fact, I can make all of the hats, so if I wanted different spores, I could get them too. I could get the green ones if I wanted to. But we'll start with blue. I like blue. Blue is my favorite color. So, we will begin with blue. Right way is the first way. Ezo? Is that what I said first? Green plus blue equals teal. I like teal. Teal is very nice. I think if I had to pick a favorite kind of blue, I'd go with like a, an electric blue. So if you see the hat, like the, the blue at the top, slightly darker than the blue at the top of the hat. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's like my favorite kind of blue. This is a little bit darker than my favorite. So maybe I'll get some... All right. Mm -hmm. Bright and light and crown mod. I installed it. I installed it. Is it not working? It's definitely not on. Hmm. Interesting. No more weeds isn't installed either. Strange. Yeah, because I... I put them in the mod installer file, but I couldn't see the... the folder for the actual mod, so I don't know. I'll have to have another look at that. It should have installed them. I do need the, the no weeds mod since I'm going to be making some farms. <laughs> See, look how powerful the, the gestalt thing is. Let me in. Disperse, you hairy cows. Update just dropped for PS4? Hell yeah. About time. Sucks that you guys get left behind a little bit, but better late than never. Swap this out. Yep, nice. Thank you. So, I can just wear this. And I'll catch the spores that pop out of there. Alright, good. So... I will make some extra boards, I think. How much? Mm, getting a little bit low. Getting a little bit low. Only have the one chest of logs. Not good enough.
Do I work on my school project that's due in four days or chill and play some Don't Starve? Hmm. That is a tough question. <laughs> I mean, I might be a little bit biased. Might be a little bit biased there. Nice. It's blue. That's a nice blue. It's a pretty blue. Get some more. Honestly, even this hat is pretty nice. <laughs> it's it's pretty pretty. A cow's not hairy. Eh. I don't know. Like when I think of a cow, I don't think of a hairy animal. It obviously has hair, but like you you look at a gorilla and you say, "Oh, it's hairy," but. A cow is just kind of, it's fine hair. Leathery. I don't know. Like, would you say a horse is hairy? Horse isn't hairy. It has hair. Like, it has a mane, but it, I wouldn't call it hairy. Oop. That's two. Uh, okay, food's going all right for now. And I should have checked how many more I needed. Damn it. Am I hairy? <laughs> I have hair. Yeah, it's a bit difficult to check without a pitchfork. Hmm. Probably around 10. Did you guys... I think it was an Australian thing, but every Australian kid would read the book um, Harry McClary. Is that something that you guys had as well? Or is it just an Aussie thing? It's about a dog. <laughs> Good book. Never heard of it? Oh man. What about the rainbow fish? Surely you know the rainbow fish, right? I don't... I, that's got to be an international thing. Rainbow fish? Yes. Okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> I remember I did a, I, I guess it, it's kind of a report, but I did a, had a project to do on it in prep. It's like the year before grade one. You don't know the rainbow fish either. Oh man, you're missing out. <laughs> uh, good fish. <laughs> it's kind of like, it's been a while since I've read it, but I think it was like the, the black sheep story, you know, fish is slightly different, um, feels bad. Feels left out, but then it ends up being beautiful or something. I don't know. <laughs> it's been a while. Something like that. Can I get a confirmation on that, Allison? Is that about the gist of it? How much has this got now? Four out of five. Yes? Okay, we got a thumbs up. Nice. Ah, <laughs> oh. Yeah, I forgot. Oops. Oh well. Dude, this says... 71. It's wrong. Yeah. Oh. Oh, damn. I thought I was... 
on the money there. Still a few to go, but that's fine. Cool. How many more? One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah, we can smash that out. Just finish it. It doesn't look right leaving it unfinished like that. It reduces hunger drain. Like, wait, does it actually? This hat. Damn. Does it? How do I not know that? <laughs> Wait, it spoils food? Hold on. Hold on. I need to look up this hat. <laughs> <laughs> I never really make them, to be honest. Alright, let's consult the wiki. Uh, when worn, they reduce the rate of hunger loss by 25%. Provide 20% wetness resistance. Oops, I heard that. And... 60 points of protection from overheating. They also periodically spawn in mushroom spores every 60 to 61 seconds. Okay. Uh, they perish over time. It takes six days to completely spoil. Perishable items stored within the player's inventory while a fun cap is equipped will spoil 50% faster. This also applies to equipable items, including the fun cap itself. <laughs> what? Wait, huh? So if you wear a fun cap and you have a fun cap in your inventory, it spoils quicker. <laughs> Quality. Um, well, in that case, I should probably put that in here. Yeah, can you, can you just put items in your backpack instead? Do they spoil? Like, will it make the things in my crown spoil? Interesting. But anyway, I got this. So... See, how many bone shards do I have? Can I request a hat game? You may not. Thank you for asking. <laughs> Maybe later. I thought Speedy was going to play today and I was going to play with him. He must have been called into work or something. I don't know. Poor guy. He's too nice. Whenever anyone asks him to work, he, he can't say no. I'm not like that. <laughs> I'm not like that at all. Whenever my boss asks me to work, he's like, wait, am I working that day? He's like, no, but we need help. No, sorry. <laughs> Can't help you there. My day off. Um, can they go in there? No. Um, so that was for bucket of poop. I need manure. One board. That's that. Bang. Yeah. Hell yeah. This one can be extra blue. Yeah. I am ailed now. <laughs> toadstool spores. Yeah, we, we saw that just before when we were fighting Toadstool and people lost a few spores in their crowns. So you probably 
gonna want to take them out. I guess. What would you do with them? You need a second crown to hold the spores while you fight with the first crown. <laughs> That's how you do it. Efficiency be damned. That's how we play now. G'day ninja. How's the day been? The day has been fine. The day has been very good. Although it's only like 10.30 a.m. so... There's plenty of time for things to still go wrong. Nah, it's fine. Um... So, looking at my little thing here. I did have a few other glow caps that I want to build, but if I do that... I'm also... my thing has run out. Uh, Eh, yeah, good enough. Or should I just wear it for the fun of it? Eh, yeah, why not? Maybe I'll put these in my fridge so they don't... Can they go in the fridge? Oh, yes. No! Hey! Where do I put them then? Put them in here. <laughs> Okay, um, I need a knapsack, yes, that's right, but in order to get that, I need a canary, and in order to get that, I need a... <laughs> you guys surely have a scarecrow, right? Just come and pinch a canary from me. <laughs> I should build my own scarecrow, actually. I didn't have that in my plan, I forgot about that. Come on, Kanoon, we both know you've got canaries. Can't hide them. I will find them. And I will kidnap one of them. And then poison him. <laughs> oh no! We just killed Toadstool so that he won't actually get poison for like another 20 days. Bugger! That sucks! Ah, <laughs> oh, never mind then. Never mind. Grab an axe app. Yeah, I, I'll do that. I'll grab one. I saw you guys had like 8 in the chest. I'll take one and then... As soon as I can make another one, I'll replace it. That'll have to be what I do. You guys don't mind? We share around here. Hmm. Not used to it. What is what is this word share? Hello. <laughs> I love when when he does like the squinty. Not that one. Not that one. That one. That one. Yeah. <laughs> the squinty eyed one. Hmm. Okay. So. When I deconstruct it, I get the canary back too. Is it volatile? It would be. So I can catch it and make another one. Damn. Massive brain.
I should take some ice too. Never have too much ice. <laughs> what is something that um, drug addicts and DST players both say? <laughs> The intersection of the two kinds of people. You can never have too much ice. <laughs> Didn't catch the first canary. Yeah, I've got a plan. I've got a plan. I'm going to put the... Um, I'm going to put the bird trap underneath the knapsack really need some yeah true shrooms as well yeah um so yes put the bird trap underneath the knapsack if that fails that fails i'll make it ice stuff <laughs> no <laughs> Was it one or two? One of them's one and one's two, I think. And I never remember which one is which. Mm. It's one and a spear. Okay. <sighs> okay. So. You gotta catch the bird. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I need the deconstruction stuff. I was like, how do I deconstruct? This is not it. That can go away. Okay. <laughs> it wants me to do the bird trap. Knapsack. Oh wow. Nah. <laughs> That's too slow. <laughs> Could have picked it up. Hmm. Right. Right. Why didn't you should have told me that before? <laughs> Oh well. We'll do it next time. We have seven other knapsacks to try. <laughs> Claws at peaking. Oh, right, all right. Oh, it's today. Okay. Let's go then. Ah, getcha. Eat a whole pot of stew by myself. <laughs> yup. Could eat a horse. Hooves and all. I'm not sure if I'll ever be able to play a game where I still learn so much despite playing 1600 hours, <laughs> 1700 now. Crazy. Wait. Thank you, Joe. G'day, Bo. Ah, oh, there are two different Pig King ones. I get it. I get it. <laughs> I 
That's that's my donation sound. <laughs> so whenever you do that, it's like ooh. <laughs> Just waiting for my hat to turn on. Ah, nice. That'll help. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there it is. How come yours is grey? What did you put in it? I like this colour. Wait, Deer Clops? Yeah, you can join in. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I didn't hear anything. All right, we should uh, we should start this fight, hey? Before winter ends. Bullets are kind of annoying. Hey, come on. Don't set him on fire. Yikes. Good night. I swear, if we get another Krampus sack. <laughs> Guess our friends kill the deer on accident. I guess they could, but they would need to do a, a fair bit of damage to kill the deer. Stop setting him on fire! So annoying. Ah, oh, this deer is blocking me so bad. <laughs> the last bit. Oh my god, he dropped a Krampus. <laughs> oh. Bip, bip. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Walter's ammo, it does. It stuffs up my kiting. Because I normally, I will dodge after someone hits first, or after I hit first. But he doesn't 
he doesn't do the swipe after the bullet because he's not there. He's not within melee range. Okay. Uh, yeah, scales. Uh, scaled furnace. Is this what we got last time? We got steel wool and scales? I'm pretty sure we did. Hmm. Interesting. Anyone want? Alright, well. You can have it, I think. And you get out of range of all the noise. Gotta go home and eat as well. Walter and Wig should form a barbershop quartet. Well, you need four people. It's quartet, not duet. Oh, hello. First week at new job and working six out of seven days. Damn. It's a trial by fire. Is it a full-time job or... They just want to see if you're any good. I guess it's good. I remember when I started at my last job. I worked like every day of the week. Well, it was, it was a five-day week. So I worked all of the five days in a row. And it was pretty rough. But it gets easier. I'm sure it'll get better, yeah. Hmm. Okay. So where are, where are my bone shards? Yeah, I will need some more. I will. Yes, I will. another one of them. I'll need some light bulbs too. Or I could just wear the glow cap, or wear the, the fun cap. And get some more of those. Yeah. Why are there still weeds? Apparently the mod's not working. It didn't install or something. I need to have a look at it. I had to take over for someone who's been there two, three months. He's being let go. <laughs> Aww. I, I th thought I did install the mod. I put it in the, the mod install file, but it didn't actually install it. I'm not sure why. I need to have a look at it. I did that a while ago though, so. There we go. Oh yeah, my, I need a new. Bug net, hmm. There it is. Those things, they actually follow you. I don't know. Interesting.
Yeah, I don't think I could work in in hospitality. I worked in a, a like a grocery store for a while, and that was bad enough. <laughs> having to having to serve people is. Man. I got respect for you guys that can do that. People just suck. Man, why do people suck so much? And to think that a lot of people grew up doing those kinds of jobs themselves and yet they still treat people who do them now so badly it's like you should know better you were like this you were being treated like this before i don't know i don't get it the fighting moose goose <laughs> yeah, I think I'll put one here. Yeah, it's pretty. Maybe I'll make this a yellow one. I don't know. Farms kind of remind me of yellow. A bit. Wicker brought in Chick fil A for lunch. But you work in a pizza place. <laughs> eat, eat the pizza. <laughs> Mamma mia. repair a few things we don't actually have chick-fil-a here I've never had chick-fil-a in my life so I don't know how good it is or bad I do know that they're like aren't they weirdly Christian or something Talk about Chick-fil-A. Is that even how you say it? I don't know. I've only ever seen it in text. I've never heard someone actually say it out loud. <laughs> but I just assume that's how it's said because it sounds like a like a fillet. Fillet fish. Yeah, good. I should have a jelly bean or something. Wait, did I put my what am I doing? Did I put it? Hmm? Yes. I'm going crazy. They're a Mormon company. Ah. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah, we don't really have Mormons here either. It's a, it's a US thing. You guys are weird. I mean, I'm sure there are some Mormons here, but I've literally never met a single one. Not that I've known anyway. Will I still get cold? I think I might. Mm. Too early in spring. Uh, yeah, I knew you were fighting the moose goose. <laughs> Right, fine. I will take. Imagine if I did that and just catch the bird. <laughs> um, so I had, was it three that was left? It's really raining, huh? Boy. Alright, that's enough. For now. You're gonna get frog rain. You know... 
I'm, this is probably going to jinx it. Not that I really believe in jinxing, but I have not had a frog rain in this world for weeks. I'm actually amazed. I hope we get one. <laughs> it's like, I need some food. Come on now. <laughs> Where do I get all my food from? That shit would last me for years. Hey. Place. The fuck? Thank you. Is that how good it is because I'm morally against him but still eat it because it's too good? Hmm. What would you guys, what is like the best fast food? If I went to America and I had to eat at like three fast food places and that's it. I couldn't pick any others. What would you recommend? They're all shit. <laughs> Come on now. Come on. There's nothing wrong with a good burger. Good boyger. Give me some recommendations then, Joe. Shake Shack. Hmm, okay. Some of them we do have here. Like, the, you know, the main ones like Macca's. You guys have Burger King. We have Hungry Jack's. It's the same thing though. Um, KFC, all of those. But yeah, we're missing quite a few of them as well. can open scale furnace with alt f4 wow amazing amazing no it doesn't work what arby's arby's i've heard of arby's burger king wendy's hmm Raising Canes. I haven't heard of that. Portillos. Hmm. I haven't heard of that either. I've heard of In-N-Out. Heard of that place. I've heard of Five Guys as well. A lot of people say that's pretty good. up with the rain raising canes only sells chicken tenders hey well chicken tendies pretty good love a good chicken tendy <laughs> right, I could put that away that's gonna spoil I think we're done with that for now Okay, I sh I've been saying this for ages. I need to organize that too. Did I put stuff in the thing? Did I just get more than I needed? There's two in there. Okay, take them back. <laughs> Alright, well if I ever go to America, I've got a lot of places to try I guess. I mean, that's such a good excuse to just eat shit food all day and just get takeaway every day. It's like, hmm, I've heard a lot about this place. I guess I should try it, you know? <laughs> I mean, only reasonable on holidays that you try all of the local cuisine. I like cooking for myself. I mean, I do. I do that myself as well. I I would say 95% of what I eat is just homemade stuff. So, I rarely, rarely get takeaway. 
And if I do, it's like 90% pizza. But when you're on holidays, like if I'm going overseas, well then that, that tips the scales a little bit, you know? Things change. Nice, okay. So, if I'm making some farms, I need a... Did I, I made myself a garden here, didn't I? The premier one. Yeah, I did. I don't think I'll really need that just yet. I will need the garden rigmajig to flint. Oh, nice. Good stuff, Joe. Good stuff. Uh, two rope, three boards. Yeah, home cooked meals are where it's at, really. They're healthier and they often taste better too. But as someone who just who doesn't eat takeaway a lot, whenever I do eat it, it's nice. So I agree, if you have it all the time, then it's nowhere near as good. But I look forward to, you know, whenever we, we have a pizza. Get myself a, a lovely capricciosa. Or maybe Hawaiian. Or maybe meat lovers. Good stuff. I like it. Not Hawaiian. What's wrong with Hawaiian? It's good pizza. Get out of here. <laughs> Look, I am Italian, all right? If I say that Hawaiian pizza is good, then it's good. You can trust me. <laughs> yeah, Australian, Italian, all right? I can be both. <laughs> I like how that immediately divides the audience. <laughs> It's good. It's like, it's a good mix between sweet and savory. They go well together, all right? You're Italian too? Oh, come on. <laughs> then you should know. <laughs> all right, how have I set this up? Okay, I'm gonna need more of these rigmajigs. It used to be my favorite pizza, to be honest. Like, legitimately my favorite. And there was never this whole kind of Hawaiian pizza is bad thing. It's only a recent thing. It was just accepted as a good pizza for ages. I don't know what happened. Who decided that Hawaiian pizza should be, you know, hated and people who like Hawaiian pizza should be persecuted? What? Why did that become a thing? Good day, Chani. Long time no see. How are you? Good day, Nomagusta. Pretty much good anyway. I agree. I agree. Pineapple is a great, great fruit. The only thing I I don't like about pineapple is um, I find it difficult to eat a lot of it at at once. It's good in in moderation. It's a it's a pretty full on. But yeah, I like it. I like it. I think maybe I like uh, acidic fruits. So I like my my citruses. And, you know, I like my green apples. Maybe that's why I like it. I like lemon on things as well. Disagree with pineapple? Come on! No! <laughs> 
Honestly, looking at the chat, it looks like it's a pretty 50-50 split between people who like it and people who don't. That's pretty cool. Thank you, Pison. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that a lot. Um. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. That's cool. It didn't show up in my in my alerts thing. That's awesome. Extend it in advance. Alrighty. Um, lemon and ricotta pizza. Yeah, ricotta is nice. Ricotta pizza, nice too. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I need more. Let me count how many I have. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So I'll need at least 3. G'day, no me gusta. Um... Need a couple boards, two... Was it two boards? Or three? I just built one. It's three, okay. Yes, very mucho flint. Very indeed. And thank you for the follow as well. Did I thank you for the follow? I think I did. I don't know. I might not have. Made a pepperoni pizza that had ricotta on top. Hell yeah! Hell yeah. I think I've said this before, but... Pepperoni pizza is not really a thing here. Like, we have it, but it's... We don't really call it pepperoni pizza. For us, pepperoni is like... When I think of pepperoni, I think of capsicum. You know, like a bell pepper. I don't know if that's us being weird or if that's just an American, Americans name things weirdly kind of thing. Maybe a bit of both. I don't know, we just, we have, it could be a spicy pizza or we have a hot salami, hot salami pizza. Sometimes people, some places do have pepperoni pizza because it's, you know what it is, but yeah. Um, one here, and did I do that side too? I have to dig that up. Let's go. Damn. Nice, Joe. You might not get the good rolls, but you get the good skins, huh? I'll probably take that. Better. I feel like I'm just making Tetris pieces. <laughs> They're all just Tetris pieces. Wait. Oh, I did this wrong. Fuck. Did I? Yeah, I did. I needed it. That goes there, and then there's one here. But I made extra, so it's fine. These can kind of go around here as decoration anyway. Maybe. And then, I need a shovel. I'll be back. Oh, 
Choco mint ice cream. Wait, you don't like chocolate mint? Oh no. <laughs> Do you guys have mint slice? It's basically the same except in, in the biscuit. It's nice. Tastes like cold toothpaste. I love the taste of toothpaste. I shit you not. When I was a kid, I used to eat toothpaste. Like, <laughs> when I was a dumb kid. I don't anymore. But I like it. It's a good taste. I like mint. <laughs> you gotta keep the insides clean, you know? I should have my shovel too. Why don't I get my shovel? Now listen. Come on. <laughs> I don't anymore. I don't. I swear. Those days are behind me. I used to do a lot of stupid shit when I was young. I used to bite my, my nails too. When I was younger. That's probably why my, my fingers look so... Shit. Oh, good. It was kind of weird. I know a lot of people bite their nails as well. It's just a, it's a habit and it's a hard habit to break. But when I was young, I don't know what it is. It's like something just snapped in my, in my brain. And I, it was something that I had been doing for years at that point. And to bite your toenails, no. <laughs> and I was just like, you know what? I'm going to stop. And then I stopped and I just, did not bite my nails ever again. <laughs> I don't know how. Just never did it. Like, yeah, I should stop. And I stopped. But yeah, it's it's not good. You realize, well, I mean, a lot of people who bite their nails know that it's not a good thing, but it's, it's not something that you can just stop. Although it was for me somehow. Maybe it's because I don't think biting my nails was, it wasn't like a stress thing. It was just a, I need to just constantly be doing something with my hands. I need to have, you know, something to, to manipulate. So that's something that I could replace. It didn't need to be, you know, my nails. <laughs> Nuggets or chips? Ooh, that's a tough one. Might be a bit controversial, but I think I'll go with chips. Probably more of a more of a chippies man myself. Chuggets, that sounds cursed. Hmm. <laughs> that sounds pretty bad. Try to grow my nails. I'm clumsy and break them all the time. Hmm. Yeah, I find that weird. I mean, I keep my nails relatively short, so that's probably why I don't have an issue. But yeah, I remember even in high school, a lot of people would just break their nails all the time. I was like, how do you do that? <laughs> Drink some more milk or something. Come on. But it's, yeah, it's probably just my nails have always been short. Yeah, it is an appropriate quote, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, so, this is my little farmland for now. 
I'm going to chuck a few other things around the place too. Not quite done yet. But it's looking good so far. Game of fingers. <laughs> I've even got little mittens on because my hands get cold. <laughs> Although they don't, they don't have the, they've got open fingers. You need the, the bit of dexterity, you know? Ah, oh, okay. That, that's not what I'm wearing. It doesn't have the fingers. And they're not yellow. Eh, uh, 16 days. I think I can get, get away with, with having that now. Now I put them in the fridge. Not that fridge, this fridge. Um, so, looking at my plan, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 11, okay, that's a uh, cultivated turf, I think I'll use, I'm not sure if I've made that, I think it was just made out of forest, I think, cultivated, Rainforest and ash. I don't make rainforest. Wait, rainforest is out of forest. <laughs> All right, make one to be able to make the other. Fine. So, wait, how many did I say? Oh, Got to count again. All right. Counts. Thank you, Joe. I want to hear something American. Peanut butter bacon. Ooh. Pretzel bun. Bacon. Crunchy peanut. Pretzel bun. Interesting. Bacon is not American though. <laughs> Crunchy peanut butter. I, I don't really like peanut butter. I like peanut butter in things. So like... Um... What do you call it? I'll have curries and stuff with peanut butter and like desserts and things with peanut butter in it, but I don't like peanut butter on its own. It actually missed. You can stop missed. Oh yeah, I don't have Oh they're doing the swishy. Peanut butter spread on apple. Ooh. 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 I mean, I, I can't really judge because I haven't had it, but it's, it doesn't sound like those things should go together. <laughs> mm. Go. Cool. We weren't even close. The other guy was close. Uh, was that Torta de Tamal? I don't know what tamal is. Torta means cake, right? It's the same in Italian. Don't I... Sometimes I kind of wish that I did like peanut butter because it's pretty high in protein, right? It has has good protein and a lot of people who are trying to like put on mass and put on weight for like building muscle and stuff will eat peanut butter. But I I just don't like it. So that kind of sucks. Same with um, sweet potato. I love regular potato. I'm not a big fan of sweet potato, but sweet potato is like much better for you. <laughs> so that kind of sucks. Maybe I just need to find a, a better way to cook it. I don't know. Tamales is Mexican food. Yeah, I know. I know. But, um... There's a lot of similarities in languages. It 
See, when I when I think of potato, I love the savory nature of it. So, when you give me a sweet potato, that's uh, that's counter to what a potato should be. <laughs> no, I don't eat it raw. For me, a potato should be savory. It's something that you eat with like, you know, oil, salt, those things. Maybe there's a way of making sweet potato savory. Just like cook the absolute shit out of it <laughs> until it's just a paste. <laughs> Need to look into that. You know, I'm glad I made breakfast this morning because all this talk of food would make me very hungry. I mean, I'm still getting hungry, but I'm okay for now. So, I was making turf. I was making turf. I had... Oh yeah, I was counting how much I need. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Nine. That'll do. Where's Speedy? I assume he's working. Poor guy. They always call him in and he cannot say no. <laughs> Honestly, it makes me a bit upset because it's like, if you don't want to work, just say no. Have some, you know, self-respect. Well, I guess it's not really respect, but... Stand up for yourself. Don't be a pushover, you know? It's just a job. Once made a turkey burger with cheese, put peanut butter, chips, and a bagel. Ooh, that sounds nice. I mean, like I said, I've got nothing against peanut butter in foods. I just don't really like it on its own. Uh, like, I won't have peanut butter on toast, for example. Now I need ash. Need 11 ash. We could get a frog rain here. Wait. Oh, I made jungle. What's this? Jungle. God damn it. I need to make... What the fuck? Why is that enormous? <laughs> Why is it massive? Man... It's cursed turf. <laughs> I need to make rainforest. <sighs> okay. Now I gotta get more. I will burn this. This cursed turf. And that'll give me the ash that I need to make the other turf. Yeah, it is Friday here. We've made it. You guys are a bit delayed. No. Ah, oh, I forgot that happened. It's raining. Are you playing this word now? Yeah, you are too. Hmm. Okay, so I need a couple more forest turf, no big deal. Sunfish, wait, do you not get wet? It doesn't negate wetness though. You just won't get cold. Still, wetness can be annoying in itself because you lose sanity and stuff. 
Oh, where it has no sanity. Right. Hmm. Okay. Fair enough. What about grip strength? <laughs> Do you still lose your grip on items? Good for you then. Makes sense. Did they change that with Wormwood as well? No? I thought they, they changed how Wormwood works with wetness. They did it for both. Alright, so I only needed 11, but I might just get a bit more. And it didn't rain. Okay. Fair enough. Go in the Discord? Nice. Discord be poppin'. <laughs> we have some good chats in there. We were talking about... This morning we were talking about Semolino. Who was it that was Italian? Was it you, Bo, that was Italian? Have you had Semolino? Someone was saying that it was shit, and I was like, bruh, Semolina's good as, what are you talking about? What is it? It's like, imagine pasta, but so small that when you cook it, it's like a paste. <laughs> Have you had couscous? It's like couscous, but smaller. It's good as. It's like polenta, but not as thick. G'day, Jazzy. Yeah, see, Jazzy knows what I'm talking about. I used to have semolina all the time. I'd come home and my nonna would make me semolina after school. It's not the most filling meal, especially if you eat it on its own, but it's nice. Okay, um, so I was making, I need to make rainforest turf this time. Rainforest turf. Savory porridge. Yeah, it depends how you make it. Someone was saying they make it with milk. It's like, I've never made it with milk, ever. I was, I make it like I would make pasta. was just half of the steps. Do that and then cultivate it. There we go. You can make it as a dessert too. I've had um, cakes. You can make like a cheesecake out of it. Out of semolina. And that's not bad, but that's not really how I eat it. Usually. I haven't had it in a while, to be fair. Just the discussion of it has convinced me to buy some more. Because I always forget. Whenever I'm looking for something to eat, it's not normally the first thing that I'll consider. But it's nice. It's like, it's not quite filling enough to be a meal, like, to have as a lunch. But it's also too much to have just to make as a snack. So it gets looked over a bit. But it's nice. I should have it some more. Uh. Uh, forest, forest, there we go. Body makes ramen with milk? What? Ramen with milk? Interesting. I 
I know semolina mainly as halva. Halva is like the, the crumbly sweet thing, right? Halva is very nice. Very nice. <laughs> I haven't had that in a long time. <laughs> There's a wet version that's less crumbly. Ah, okay. Interesting. I haven't had that. Yes, Holva, very nice. I haven't had that in a while though. Hmm. We used to get it. We had like a, a deli that would have these kinds of European specialties. That being one of them. How did I do this? I need to... I'm going to put a few tiles of this. Because if you have just one, it just gets swallowed up by this. They need a little bit more. And I think it even goes underneath the savanna turf. So that's why I've got a little bit extra. Oh, it goes under that too. Hmm. Maybe not. I don't really like that. Maybe I'll put lawn turf instead. Hmm. Maybe lawn turf. For that I would need um, nida and stuff. Nida, oh and petals. There should be some petals around. Savory, Halva. It's not savory though. It was uh, the one that I had was very sweet. But you're welcome. <laughs> Any kind of Halva, I'm sure, is good. How come that one is normal? Just the jungle turf was very weirdly large. Oh, thank God, the rain. Ugh. The rain stopped my voice. <laughs> um, so, lawn turf. Lawn turf. Lawn turf. I've never made lawn turf before. There it is, yeah. Nida and petals. So I need 11. Alright, let's get 11 petals. Hey, it's a box. Nice. Come on! <laughs> uh, that lasted all of about 20 seconds. Because it's, it's goose season, that's why. You fight goose, you get the rain. That stone to stretch out the cobble. Yeah, that's that's specifically what I use it for. Because the cobble is too too thin. And if I do two cobble, then it feels too thick. Bit annoying. It just means that you need so much rocks though. So many rocks. Any more? How many did I need? Eleven. It might be just enough. Maybe? There we go. Rain probably makes it lag a bit too. And it makes it dark. I don't like the darkness. Oh. I wonder how long that's been lost there. <laughs> the bird. I should get some more grass and twigs and stuff.
How would I rate Joe's castle? Uh, 0 out of 10. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Why you gotta build it in front of my castle, huh? Why? It's where things get demolished. Mom loves dragonflies, IRL, showed a deep fly in the game, she got, that is a drag. Well, I mean, it's not really. I, I like dragonflies. I haven't seen a, a real dragonfly in a long time, actually. I feel like they're, they're dying out. Or maybe it's just not really a, a city, a city suburbs thing. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Maybe we'll just keep it like that. I did... I kind of wanted the natural look. This looks a little bit too... I'll finish it. We'll see how it looks when I do the rest of it. Maybe it'll look better when I complete more of it. Hello, Allison. Yeah, I think I might go with the natural look. Sorry, I'm so picky. <laughs> it's got to be perfect, alright. Check your trousers, wow. I mean, it doesn't look bad. It just... It doesn't look like... Uh, hmm. Do I just go with forest turf? Or the... Oh my god. Getting very wet. Or maybe the... Uh, what is it called? The one in the caves? Slimy turf? Floyd Mayweather of Hat Game. Who is it? Who's undefeated? Canoon. <laughs> Allison. Ooh, okay. Yeah, what do you guys think? Would it look better with forest turf or slimy turf? Hmm. A picture of gold dragonfly. Ooh, interesting. All right. It would also look better with actual crops in there, but that's that's something for another time. I might see what it looks like with forest turf. Also, I love the new graphics for the moons. That looks so cool. It is Lawn Turf, yes. That's from Hamlet. So, oh, I only have eight. You know, I, I have Slimy Turf over here. Maybe I'll use just Forest Turf. We'll try with that. See how that goes. Heard the new update brought infinite light. It did bring infinite light, yes. In the form of this crown. You can deconstruct it and you get 
the the five pieces and they they last forever you can put them in glow caps and whatever you like All right, let's try that Ooh, yeah yeah I think that looks better it just it looks more natural I probably need to get rid of all of this savannah turf but that just yeah <laughs> the difference is massive Didn't I get rid of that bunny? They can't make new holes. Hmm. Maybe it just spawned in. Because I can't put the rigamajig down with the hole there. I don't think. Uh, I'll leave it there. It's not on the farm. It can stay. You're lucky, Mr. Bunny. <laughs> I'm feeling generous today. Yeah, that looks way better. Okay. The hat plus makes you immune to gestalts and gives you ten. Yeah, it's it's insane. Plus, it the hat itself gives you light too. When you have above eighty-five percent sanity, so very powerful. I do have a mod, yes, a mod for the... I have Hamlet and Shipwrecked Turfs. Both mods. I like my Turfs. It's nice having extra additional options, you know? There aren't enough Turfs in this game. I think everyone can agree on that. Yeah. Excuse me? Just pinched it. <laughs> Took it back. What'd you say, Joe? Well, yeah, I know, right? I have so many keys that are bound to like two or three different mods. So I press one. Like I press F5 to cry and it does. What is endless deploy true? What is that? <laughs> I don't even know what mod that's from. <laughs> I just wanted you to cry a moment. <laughs> Auto work mod? Something like that. And uh, one over here maybe? Yeah. Okay, that'll eventually grow. I really like the look of the birch nut trees. It'd be nice if we had more trees too. Maybe... I miss the tea trees. The tea trees from Hamlet. They are lovely. They're actually gorgeous trees. I wish we had them. You guys really drop a lot of seeds, huh? I'm trying to get me to plant stuff maybe? Maybe I should plant stuff actually. And I should make a salt box and things while I'm here actually. I feel like I say actually a lot. I've got to stop doing that. It annoys me. It probably annoys you guys too. <laughs> Actually... <laughs> hmm. It'll do. It'll do. Tea trees with picos. Yeah. That's exactly what I was talking about. I like them. They were rad. It was a shame that the picos would go extinct though. Although... Eh, they could be a bit annoying. Oh yeah, I said I wanted to get grass and twigs. Let me do that. Picos were a bit annoying. There were so many really cute creatures in Hamlet that were just oh, pain in the ass. <laughs> like the was it the pogs? God, they were annoying, <laughs> but they were very cute. 
I'm with Picos. Even Robin. Robin looked cute, but Robin was annoying as hell. Red Moon? It's a, it's a mod. I have a mod that changes the coloring of the different seasons and it changes the full moon as well. I feel like I might tinker with it a little bit. The red can get a little bit intense. It's a little bit too red. It's supposed to be like the Apocalypse, but I don't remember Apocalypse being this red. Mm, I don't know. Maybe it's just been a while. Alright, I'll check it out afterwards, Bo. Yeah, look how, how good these trees look. Might want to put a few more things. What could I put around these trees? Maybe I should have made that one tile instead of four. Oh, I could have... Uh, I like the look of this now. I feel like I like these trees even better when they're... The orange colors, the brown, the, the reddy colors. I think that's even nicer. Berry bushes? I'm out of berry bushes. I don't know if they even are anymore. <laughs> they're all... They've been taken. I may be able to find a few in the caves or something. Maybe. Do I need twigs as well? Let me check my stocks. Hmm. It's okay for now. Grass, probably I need a bit more than twigs. Because grass gets used a lot for rope. Twigs, twigs is just for tools. I don't always make too many tools, so I've got plenty. Okay, so next I... I guess I'll just plant the seeds that I have. I don't really have any specialized seeds. Maybe we'll try to grow some potatoes in the future, but for now we'll just get whatever we've got. I may need some salt boxes, some extra ones. I think I had salt near. Yeah, there's salt nearby, so that shouldn't be too hard to get. And I don't know what to do with this blue spore. Wait. Okay. G'day, Robin. Good to see you. Yeah, I like this. I like how it's, you know, a proper city in the middle. CBD, a hub. I need to change these. Oh, I should do that too. Were they... Some of them are grim, yeah. And then on the outside, it's a bit more chaotic. It's like the suburbs. It's got a nice vibe to it. A few more, you know, trees. A bit more unkempt. A bit more wild. I like building the little... I like it when my base has a theme to it. It's more fun to kind of... It's, it's like it has a story. You can follow along, you construct it, and it, it constructs its own... ...law. <laughs> you know, you got the little pig suburb out here, these guys got their own houses and stuff. Yeah, it's fun. Time family friend woke up from her coma and is back home. Amazing. That's awesome news. Fantastic. I can't even imagine what's that what that's like. I don't think I've had anyone ever that I know 
be in a coma. Yeah, very good news. I'm happy to hear it. I'm ask if it's worth growing marble trees with enhanced tree growing modification. What do you mean? I think marble trees are worth growing because it's I find marble can be a bit annoying to get a lot of. I mean, is this is this three by three? It is, so I only need nine. Um, yeah, let me let me put nine here. I like marble too. The checkered flooring looks nice. Marble statues look nice. Even the marble trees themselves, you can use them as decoration. They look pretty nice too. Can't really go wrong. Thank you, Sorichi, for the follow. Welcome on in. Grab yourself a little chair. Make some snacks. G'day, my Linka. Okay, I'm thinking at this stage, I don't think I need another kitchen. And if I did, I might even put it outside of the castle. So it could just be maybe statues, have like a few trophy rooms. I could put statues, I could put fish, and I could put um, produce, potentially. So... And then a kitchen. <laughs> the kitchen doesn't really fit, but whatever. And this one, I think the two outside ones were going to be marble as well. So if I could get just two more marble, I might convert them as well. In fact, no, that's all I had. Yeah, whatever. Mm. Okay, good. These look really cool in the blue color. I like it. Was I gonna build here? Let me see. This was. What is that? Um. Ah, oh, this could be like tent and stuff. And maybe a meat effigy. <laughs> Not that I'm worried about dying or anything, but it can never hurt to have a bit of insurance. And, I mean, there's really no reason not to make one in DST, because you can get the health back, even if you haven't used it. Unlike single player, where you build one and you've permanently lost the health, right? So, I don't know why it does that. G'day, Zuriki. Good to see you. Um. Yeah. It's just nice to have it a bit fleshed out. And I think that would be carpet. Gee, these ones look very similar. I don't have carpet. I might have some in a chest. What is that? Eh, hey, carpet flooring. Okay. It has been a while. Yeah, how have, have you been? Just been doing my thing. 
still here. <laughs> Uh, 13, that will be more than enough. I might have to shave a few. Why did it, mm. I need more logs. Oh, no. That time again. Yeah, got to plant some trees. Wait, have I not made carpet flooring? I just dug it up. Okay. Old bell, yeah. Old bell would be nice. Or Wagstaff's thumper. I wouldn't mind that either. Do you guys think that we'll get Wagstaff in the game eventually? I mean, he's in the game, technically, but as a playable character. Some people have said that, you know, seeing him as an NPC proves that he can't be in the game. But I don't know. It could just, you could really, you could explain it away by just saying, oh, you know, that was a projection. It's not the real Wagstaff. So it's pretty easy to explain away. Having said that, I don't think he will be in the game. But it is a possibility. Blueprints for his machines. Yeah. It would be cool if you interact with him a little bit more than just him giving you the goggles and you help him to make the thing. The refined static. Um, I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'll be back very shortly. Alrighty, I'm back. What did I get today? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Not bad. I've been getting a lot of spiffy items, which is surprising because um, looking at the statistics of the drops that I've been getting, I have been I normally get less spiffy than everything else. I'm not sure why. Maybe it's it's finally starting to even out. A game. Oh, well, in in time, in time. Don't worry. <laughs> there will be a time for a game. Not just yet. Not yet.
Alrighty. Hmm. Guys are a bit sus. Alright, did I did I turf at all? I did. So it'd be nice if I could put that just chuck it on there. And what am I gonna do with it? I can't eat it. I could just let it go. But I don't know. I've held on to it for so long, I feel like I should just keep holding it now. <laughs> um I do need light bulbs. I have so many glow berries, but not light bulbs. Mm. Okay, oh yeah, we were planting stuff, so How's my gold? I get distracted so easily. Still alright for gold. But I will need a splendid garden hoe. Okay. Need one of them. The rain is back again. Luku's back again. Am I British? I'm not British, no. I'm Australian. So, um, how do I turn the, no, not that, that one. Do Australians hate British? No, not really. We like to beat them in sports, but we like to beat everyone in sports, really. <laughs> have I seen a kangaroo in real life? I have. I've seen many kangaroos, yes. Many. Um, I went on holidays to Tasmania last week, and we saw some little kangaroos. Actually, they might have been wallabies that we saw, because they were very small. I think they were wallabies, but the place that I used to live was like right on the border of the suburbs, where the suburbs meets like the rural area, and there would always be heaps of kangaroos, especially near the place where I used to go to play tennis. It was, a, it was just a big open area, it's a lot of, a lot of bush. I think I will till all of this soil, because if you till the soil, it doesn't grow weeds naturally, right? <laughs> it's only if it's vacant soil. It do! No! They take the spot, bastards! Well, it looks nicer anyway. You should have eaten kangaroo meat. Why should I have eaten that? It's pretty expensive. And as far as I can tell, it wouldn't taste any better than just regular beef. It's like a, it's a game meat, isn't it? So it'd be more, I don't know, more stringy. Boy, I'm getting wet here. Mamma mia. Are emus everywhere? I don't know if I'd say everywhere. I don't... You don't see emus in the same way that you see kangaroos, that's for sure. It's tasty? Alright, well, maybe I'll have to try some. I've probably had it at some point, but I don't remember it being particularly noteworthy you wear Lord of the Fruit Flies uh, Joe has penned the Fruit Fly Queen somewhere somewhere far away so you don't have to worry about that swamp alright there you go it's out of the swamp although it sucks that you can't get more 
More Georgies. Miss my little Georgie friend. Help me, you know, nourish all of my plants. Oop. Can you still get one downstairs as well? You can get one up, one down. Yeah. It's a bit of a shame. Yeah, this looks nice. Bring that down up. I don't think you can take the... Um, what is it? The fruit fly fruit. You can't take it upstairs. I don't think. Alright, I've got 42. This is definitely more than 42. <laughs> so... Um, I might just... Plant the closest ones to the middle. And we'll work our way back. All the ones like on the edge of the path. See you, boo. Thanks for dropping in. I may still be here when you get back, maybe. I do need food, but... Doggy doggy. An hour to commute. Damn, that's a long commute. You know what sucks? It sucks when I live by car, maybe 20 minutes from the city. But if I were to take public transport, it takes me like 45 minutes to get in just because of traffic and the route that it takes. That kind of sucks. <laughs> You're just wasting time. And, you know, constantly having to stop to let people on. Pain in the ass. Is that all of it? Oi. Let me in. <laughs> if I try from the other angle. Let me have it. Come on. There we go. It was just one. Why were you guarding it like that? Ooh. Yes. <laughs> they helped me fight it. I gotta make a boat of these. Yeah. I need to make a boat of these. I have a few as well. I think I have five or something now. And I need to make a, make some bee boxes too. Six. Yeah, I think you can still fit around 10 on a boat. Somewhere around there. Or if I really wanted to, I could put desert turf or some other turf where they don't spawn the eye plants. But I feel like it's not really worth it. It's a lot easier just to make the boat. Why do I have an upgraded garden hat? Why not? I don't want a basic garden hat. You go all out here. I knew that I would be doing some gardening, so I was like, well, I might as well give myself the best quality hat. The mod, so I don't need the hat. You know what that sounds like, Joe? It sounds like cheating. 
<laughs> but you do you. You know, I'm not gonna not gonna judge. Besides the judging that I just did. Stopped. It's a miracle. Pineapple pizza man. Hey. I'm happy about that. Alright. That is not an insult to me. That is a hill I will gladly die on. So, now that I've got that, I'm going to need... Ooh, should I put some fences? No, later, later. <laughs> I'm going to need a <laughs> uh, one-man band. Somewhere, where is it? One-man band, there it is. Two pigskin, it's very cheap. Very cheap. If you pay attention to plants and a simple gardening hat will do. Yeah, I'm sure it would, but look, I, I've i got so many resources, right? Five thulacite or four thulacite or whatever it is, and a purple gem is nothing to me. It's nothing. It's like one flint. <laughs> Uh, and they got watered from the rain too. <sighs> nice. Very happy. They need more water. Hmm. Well, they might get it, whether they want it or not. And spores eat stuff? I don't think so. No. <laughs> are, are they alive? I guess they are. Got mods for everything. No, I don't. I mean, I have, I have several quality of life mods, but mods make the game better. It is fact. I, I think I want to get some light bulbs. Makes me a little bit nervous playing with with it like that. You really you shouldn't judge people for playing with mods. People play it as a game. Whatever makes it more fun, go for it, you know? And you also shouldn't close yourself off from the idea that a mod could make the experience more enjoyable for you. There are some mods that I don't play with because I feel like it's too much. But I I won't criticize other people for using them. Good night, Katarina. How you doing? Good morning. Morning? I think it's still morning. Oh, not for me anymore. Damn. <laughs> it's probably morning for you though, so that's good enough. Um, well, if I'm just getting light bulbs, I can go down. I can go down this one. Three hours of sleep. Oh my. Three hours. Tell me something. Sometimes I feel like when I get no sleep, I'm talking like, like you had three hours, four hours of sleep. Sometimes I wake up and I'm just super switched on. Is that a thing? I, I don't understand that. And then there'll be other times where I'll sleep like 11 hours. And I wake up and I feel like I've just been hit by a wave of jet lag or something. <laughs> Brain is weird. So weird. <laughs> Brain is dumb. Come on, Brain. 
You're better than this. <laughs> ah, so I need to remember. This is the one that's near the blue. Not that I need it anymore, but... Where I found this guy. Maybe I should leave him in his home. He could go do some good. Instead of just expiring in my... <gasps> there is a berry bush here. Well. Well, well, well. Oh, take that. <laughs> that's rare. Things are uncommon these days. Been daydreaming all night. Wait, say that again. Daydreaming all night. <laughs> nah, it's fine. It's, I think it's just regular dreaming. <laughs> uh. It doesn't look like it's raining all that much in the caves, but it it hits differently. All right. This is where we part ways, Blue Spore. It's been fun. We had good times together. But we must go our separate ways. Thank you for the memories. Everyone say goodbye to Blue Spore. Maybe we'll meet again someday. Yeah, go be with your friends, the green spores. <laughs> Play nice. Nah, they don't fight. Spores don't fight. They're peaceful people. He's not gonna get bullied? No. They don't do that. Bullying doesn't even exist, alright? With spores? No. Remember when we were talking about, earlier today, we were talking about the, the rainbow fish? Be like that, you know? He's a little bit different, and they'll come to realize that he is special. This is me now. <laughs> trying, to, trying to do gardening with, uh, with a pitchfork. No, not a pitchfork, yeah, a pickaxe. Nelson. Uh huh. Yeah, I get what you mean, Katarina. It's always like when you're trying to shut off that your mind just goes goes into full full blown conspiracy mode and just thinking about everything and existential crisis and just life itself <laughs> yeah I think everyone understands that You aren't there to take care of him. I don't need to take care of him anymore. He's grown up. He can take care of himself, Blue Spore. I have faith. Sometimes, I know it's hard. I know it's hard to, you know, have the little ones grow up and, and, and leave the nest, so to speak, but it has to happen. You can't keep him forever. Nice. Okay, so do I want the forget me lots? Maybe I will grow them. Make some tea or something. I will get rid of this one though. No, thank you. <laughs> and. 
Let me actually... Have I... I think I've completed this. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yay. Hell yeah. The science machines? Um, they are to stop trees spawning in that area. Normally you build things like fences, but... Uh, Joey was saying that Moose Goose would destroy the fences. Yet yeah, doesn't destroy the science machines, so it works well. Do I chuck a berry bush in here? Why not? Why not? Where should I put it? Maybe Maybe the next to this tree over here. Yeah. <laughs> Moose Goose is a scholar. <laughs> Okay, good. These are slowly gone. Do they... Mm, do they need water? I wonder. I think I have some... Do you guys have any blueprints for the, the waterfall can? Because you've got a, a fair few uh, Malbatross feathers. Just wondering. I have a few cans. Yeah, but if I... Eh. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I don't want to kill Malbatross, no. <laughs> I don't want to. Malbatross is annoying. <sighs> um, I know Speedy IRL in real life. Not Allison, no. I think that was, if you're talking about the most recent video, that was just on the dedicated server. That was just like this. I think Joe was there too. And Kanoon. I think they were both there, yeah. Um, I need to get some food. I remember there was a... suspicious dirt... Oh, there you are. Yeah, that's right, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Tim got a good roll. Win in tic-tac-toe. Tic-tac-toe, is there even a way to win? Don't you just get to a point where it's just constant stalemate? Oh, don't you dare go back in. Oh no, it's out here. The guy I'm always playing with on YouTube. That's Speedy, yeah. I know Speedy in real life. And I know... Cliffy and Emily as well. They sometimes play with me. Watch this one be a vag. <laughs> and... Vag. Yep. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> All right. Well, we got um, we got the horny beefs, so no big deal. Hey, come on, come this way. Don't everyone have to befriend Pearl? No, you actually don't. You do not have to. The only um. There you go, that was easy. You only need Pearl to get the... The Pearl. Pearl's Pearl. And only one person needs to be friends with Pearl to get that from her. How did I discover this game? Probably the same way that most of you guys <laughs> discovered it. I watched someone play on YouTube and I was like, huh, that game looks cool. <laughs> and then, yeah, I looked it up on Steam and I said to Speedy, I was like, hey Speedy, if I get this game, would you play with me? 
And he said, yeah, hell yeah, demon, I will play that game with you. And so we did. True story. <laughs> You know, I probably ended up getting more food from this than I would have if it was a koala. I guess that's a win. Yeah, I got 12 instead of 8. Saw it on the Apple store. Wow. Interesting. I'm a PC gang. <laughs> uh. Okay. Um maybe just make maybe fifteen apes. I like Pearl. Wait, did my bird die? Oh it died, okay. Rip. More food for me. I do like Pearl. I I remember I was gonna consider helping her out because I had just found where she lives and the next day I come on the server and it had already been done so I was like all right fine beat me to it <laughs> no need it does take a long time to fulfill all her quests so it saved us a lot of time in um, in you know doing the crab king fight and building from that to work towards the celestial champion but yeah I was gonna do it and it was already done I'm good friends with Pearl in my solo world we have a good good uh, relationship we bonded I don't really want to fight Malbatross. <laughs> the hardest part about the Malbatross fight is finding Malbatross. When I did that in my solo world, it actually took me days. Keeping her aggroed. Eh. You can... If you're good at placing yourself on the boat... You can normally get enough hits in to skip the phase where she will try to run away. Otherwise you can get a weather pane or a, a flute, oh not a flute, um, a blow dart or something like that. Find bass and keep fishing. Yeah, I did. I was fishing that bass for three days. <laughs> it was very painful. Sometimes you get unlucky, I guess. Let's look at our crops. I wish I could hire someone. Just take one of those pigs from the village over and just get him to look after my crops for me. Hire a farmer. Exactly. I should build a house and give him a straw hat, but it expires. That's the only thing. By the time I come back, the straw hat will be done. Infinite hat mod. Is that a thing? I mean, of course it's a thing, isn't it? Okay, um, I need ice. I need ice. My first favorite character? You're looking at him. You're looking at him. He's the best one. Was there ice nearby? 
I thought there was. There's some over there. Let's have a look at that. Three waterfall cans. Don't suppose I could take one. <laughs> Big canoe in soccer. Soccer? Favorite skit in the game? You're looking at it. <laughs> I really love this one. The diving suit. It's fantastic. It's just, it's such a good idea. That's part of the reason why I like WX so much. There are so many concepts that you can use. Because, I mean, it's just robot. You can do any kind of robot, you know? Just waiting for an Iron Man skin. <laughs> Iron Man WX skin. So good. I like the furnace one too. Uh, there's a potato skin. How can you, how can you go wrong with a potato skin? stop raining. Uh, I need this ice if I want to make the tea as well, don't I? So, yeah, more. Yeah, I could check out these bits here while I'm here. Old Tato. I should have some potatoes soon. I have a few. I have a couple in my in my cupboard. Just sitting, waiting, patiently. The tea freezes you, does it? Does it make you cool? That's fine. It gives you sanity. It's actually quite useful when wearing the crown. As Allison pointed out to me. I really love when Clay introduces items that make other items previously not super useful in the game have more of a purpose. I think it's really, really good game design. Look at that, 40. I'll probably end up using most of this just for meatballs. Because it'd be like that. Jelly salad, that's good too. Yep, jelly salad's good. And I said I wanted to make some of that as well. I wanted to plant the, the fleshy bulbs on a boat. But I need some honey. Honey is going to be the harder one to set up. Yeah, I know, you guys got heaps of honey. I might pinch some of yours for the moment, but I would like to set up my own if I can. I like to do things myself. I know you guys have everything that I could possibly want in the game, but it's, um, it's not as much fun. To just rely on other people for everything. And if you take out the stage of the game where you set up all of those kind of systems, then there's not much left. It's like if you play The Sims, but 
as soon as you get in the game, you start with mother load, you know, you give yourself 50 grand or more to build the house of your dreams. Well, I mean, yeah, you've beaten the game without even playing it. <laughs> What's the point? What's the point of playing it then? That's why people get bored of it. Hello. Bye. Do I need honey for the forget me lot recipe? You do, don't you? Mmm. Where did you guys put your beep? Ah, oh, they're over there. Yeah, I'm still not sure why Joe built all the science machines, especially if you're going to put the wooden flooring. It's kind of moot, isn't it? Uh, I might take a little bit of your honey. Thank you guys. Why am I not maxed out on gears? I am. I just don't have full health. I wasn't maxed out for a long time though. I normally, I only eat the gears if I need health or sanity and I just didn't for ages. <laughs> it took me a good few hundred days to, to fully upgrade. I mean, I don't need 400 health. I really don't. It's a lot. And in, in some cases, it could even be bad. Like, if you're trying to go insane, you need to lose a lot of sanity to get down there. But, yeah. Over time, eventually you get there and that's it. Okay, let's put this stuff in here, maybe. Yeah, make some tea. I might just... I might make some and bundle it up. Maybe. I got heaps of bundles. Bomber group. Yeah, well, if I have full sanity... Look, 300. So if I want to go down to zero, I need to eat six Loma Goop. It's a lot. I think it's six. Does it lower by 50? A lot. Loma doesn't poop all that often, you know? Yeah, but that's from 2700 days. Yeah, 
I know you ate some, but still. And I'm sure you're not actively gathering it either. But I'm just saying. Just saying. Alright, this is T. How do I remember that this is T? Let me make a T. I was thinking I'd put it under the, underneath the tea tree, but we don't have tea trees. Um, I need to make a sign for it, but I'll do that another time. I need to make signs for my chest as well, but I'll do that another time. Hmm. Need more chests, but for more chests, I need more wood. For more wood, I need more trees. I got potatoes. If I want more trees, I need to plant them. Hmm. Okay, well... Um, I might leave this hat here too. I'm only going to use it here, so... Take the potatoes. Make a mini sign. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I need to make a sign. That would be helpful. Potatoes! These grow out of season? Oh no, we got a few. What a malol. Eggplant. Hmm. Do you guys like eggplant? I'm not super keen on eggplant. No, nah, none of these ones would have been giant plants because they were all just from basic seeds and I, they wouldn't have got the family bonus. But I will. It's something that I'll do eventually. Now that I have the seeds, it'll be a lot easier to do that. But these are all probably going to spoil. That's the thing. These things spoil very quickly. I should bundle them. Again. I would need like three bundles. Yikes. Hey, there it is. Right, yeah, looks good. Wow, schoolboy uniform. Hey, hey, looking snazzy there. That's for Weber, right? Awesome. <laughs> Very stylish. Do you ever just, like, get a really good skin that makes you want to play that character? I don't really play Weber that much, to be honest. But if I had a good skin like that, maybe I'd consider it. My goal? I would love to make... A lot of bundles with just uh, very special recipes. I'm talking things like moqueca and asparagus spacho and stuff like that. That'd be cool. I'll probably need to change to Wali to grow a lot of that though. Oh, whoops. Um, Alright, I'll be back. And also, if I'm going to be putting a lot of produce scales in here, that means I'm going to have to take all those giant crops a fair distance. So I might want a bit of assistance there. May want to enlist the help of a, a beeflo or something. Maybe. I have to think about it.
It sucks that there are just slightly too many crops to all fit in one fridge. I think there are... How many are there? Like 11 or something? The fridge can hold 9. Bit disappointing. Ah, oh, this one's bolting. Damn. Alright, gotta get rid of that. Um... I don't really care if these grow or not. <laughs> Should I dig them up? Might dig them up. Get extra anyway. So we can make a fair bit of tea with this as well. It's probably just enough. I think I had about that many, that many honey, so it'll work out well. And I'll, I'll replenish the soil, retill it. Hey, go not? Thank you. Remember when they had giant ice boxes? They had giant ice boxes. I don't remember that. Was this in like the the early access or something? Must have been before my time. How long do you reckon Don't Starve is going to be around? Because it's, it's quite an old game. They don't need to worry about the graphics going out of date or anything. Because it's it's cartoon style or whatever style it is so that doesn't matter it could be around for a fair while yeah I don't know if I'd say forever I'm trying to think of of games that have a similar kind of longevity. Like, you could probably say the same thing about games like Minecraft. Like, when is Minecraft gonna... gonna bite the dust? Not anytime soon, you'd have to say. TF2? Mm, yeah, there's still a big following for TF2. But it's, it's nowhere near as much as it was back in its heyday. I feel like this is DST's heyday, you know? There are more people playing DST right now than there have been in the past. I wanna... I guess I'll bundle it. You know what, I will check my, my hat, I'll check the recipe thing, I want to see what crops I want to grow right now, and I'll grow them, although, maybe I should do it next time, because if it grows while I'm off, then they're going to spoil and stuff, and that's no good, yeah, we've got doggos, doggos, poppers, Terraria, yeah, Terraria is a good example, although they they finished the updates, right? 1.5, was it 1.5? No, 1.4, right? 1.4, 1.5, I don't know. But the, the journey's end is, well, the end. So they're not really going to update it anymore. Whereas you look at a game like Don't Starve and games like Minecraft, they... They are still planning on upgrading, updating them. Games like Valorant starting to rise. Valorant is still a very new game though. It's, it's yet to stand the test of time. But it, it is quite popular at the moment, that's for sure. And I guess you could say that kind of genre has been popular forever. You know, how long have people been playing Counter-Strike? Counter-Strike's been around for ages. 
wasn't Counter Strike started as like a mod for Half Life, right? Is that right? Man. Let me in, you smellies. Thank you. I've personally never really played games like Valorant and, and Counter-Strike. I haven't even really played TF2. Not much of it anyway. I played Quake Live a lot and that was enough for me. You've never heard of Counter-Strike? Wow. Surprising. It's very popular. It's on Steam, it's like in the top two most played games or three, like all the time. Um, yeah, okay. I'll bundle it and then maybe I'll just plant some more plain seeds. See if we can get more. We just need more variety. Don't really need anything in particular at the moment. Um, well, I do need food. Yeah, I'll take a few of these. To like to work out what it is that I want. So. those on the limb up I think potatoes will have to be one of the first ones no no till weed don't want to smelly till weed <laughs> Kind of interesting that there are so many recipes that are kind of OP. If you had to live with just one meal, you could only pick one meal, there are plenty of options. Like you could you could live off honey ham for the rest of your life. You could live off bacon and eggs for the rest of your life. Dragon pie for the rest of your life. Even meatballs. I do. Meaty stew. There are so many options that are good options. And it's probably a good thing, I'd say. But it makes harder to, to work out what I want because everything is good. Ooh, should I put them over, over by the farm? I don't know. Mandrake soup, yeah, it's a, bit, a little bit harder to make, but yeah. What was that? My phone's broken. It still makes noise even though I put it on silent. <laughs> When I started my new world in Rain of Giants, I said there was no overload. Huh. Is it worth making a new world? Or should I just ignore it? When did you make this world? 121 days is not that much, I guess. Oh yeah, I wanted to... These... 18. Okay. Only have nine.
Oh yeah, I need more ice, don't I? I have a... Uh, I have an S7. No, S7? I have iPhone 7, not S7. I have a, an iPhone 5 as well that I sometimes use. That one's definitely broken. <laughs> it's lasted a long time though. I can't really complain. Found the ruins. How do I get all of the Thulacite? How do I get all of the Thulacite? The best way to get it is to um, mine down the statues, the ancient statues. That are in the ruins. You can hammer the walls, but you'll only get thulacite fragments. And it's probably more effort than it's worth. Because then you need... I think it was six... Six or seven fragments makes one thulacite. So, I don't think it's really worth it. But you can if you want to be thorough. Alright, that's nice tea. Nice tea there. 18 tea? Yeah. Hell yeah. I like tea. British. No. <laughs> what type of music do I listen to? Ooh. At the moment, I've been listening to... Um... I guess you'd say alternative... Alternative rock rock kind of pop ish right at this moment but my I would say the main genre that I listen to would be rap hip hop some R&B as well I like pop I like EDM dance um, electronic it's all good I, I have a pretty diverse taste when it comes to music I need some food for myself. Oh, hmm. Maybe I should have kept some of that. Some of the veggies. <laughs> hey, bird. Hey, bird. <laughs> Name a band. Um, at the moment, I've been listening to a lot of Spacey Jane. They're an Australian band, so you probably haven't heard of them. If you're outside of Australia. But yeah, they're pretty good. Who do I think is the best character? Uh, well, I mean, I like WX, but that's just me. I think there are a lot of different characters that will suit your needs depending on how you play. It does depend how you play, though. If you like fighting and you want fighting to be easier, then you could go, you know, Wolfgang, Wigfrid, WX, Wartox. Uh, if you like chilling and you don't really want to be in the thick of the action all that much, then you could go Wormwood, Wirt, Wicker, those kind of characters. I'm 27, do I want to plant it now? Mm. Word is Army Commander. Yeah, but... She doesn't really get in the fight herself, you know. You can delegate that to other people.
But honestly, you, if with enough practice and enough kind of just spending time with a character, you get used to pretty much anyone. You can make it work to your playstyle. There are only a couple of characters that I just think don't suit me. And I mean, obviously Wes, but that's just because Wes is meant to be like that. So many mooses. Meese? Wormwood is permanent garden. Wormwood's nice. Wormwood's a very cozy character. I like spending time as Wormwood. It's always good fun. Yeah, I think if I was to go with potatoes. Was it potatoes and carrots or something? Yes. Potato. So down, down, two up. So I need up, up, two down. Up. Up, up, two down. Tomatoes. Potatoes, tomatoes. There we go. The match made in heaven, those two. Potatoes, tomatoes. First you get the pasta. Then you get the salsa. <laughs> Molto bene. Let's give it poop. Why? There's no need. Let's make plant the birth together and then you don't even need to worry about it. You just come back every few every day or so to talk to your plants, sing them a song, and you are good. Giant crops all but guaranteed. Uh, I should have left this there. Farming on easy mode. Yeah, but I think I'll come back to these crops. The good thing, they... I love the way that they... They rejigged it. So that if the crops... Grow, and you're not there, they spoil. After a few days, they will... Just turn into the crop again. So I could leave this for... A year. Come back. And they'll still be growing. Which is pretty nice. And in a way, it kind of mimics the way it would work in real life. Because when you grow your crops, eventually, you know, they're ready, you pick them. If you don't pick them, or sometimes even if you do pick them, you use the leftovers or you, yeah, you reuse it as compost to help you grow the next thing that you grow. So it's cool. I wonder, it would be interesting if like you just plant a regular seed, right? You plant a regular seed in the soil, it grows into a carrot, let's say. And you might not want a carrot, so you let it spoil, it rots, it becomes, you know, a seed in the soil again, and then maybe it grows into something else. That'd be cool. Because it's not always the right season for a carrot. Actually, it might, it might be carrots might grow every season, I don't remember, but it would be kind of cool if it would favor the crops that grow in season. So you might have something that you planted in winter and you just leave it for so long that it, it becomes spring the next time you check on it and it could be another, another plant. No, it's not how it works, Katarina, but I'm just saying it would be cool if it did. <laughs> it would be nice. But it might be a little bit too hard to do, I don't know. Jeez, this rain. This rain. It's almost summer though. We've almost made it. Guys just farming the freaking feathers all year. And we did get a frog rain again. Do I need to check if frog rains are on? I swear I have not had one for years. I have not had one for years. What you're talking about real life? Well, see, that's what I mean. Because that's kind of how it does work in real life. Kind of. Although, actually, well, if I mean, if you plant only a carrot, then you're only ever going to get carrots because it grows from the seed. 
I think we're gonna leave it there. Thank you guys. Thank you, Cobra and, and Canoon. It was fun. Because like the way my nonna grows a lot of crops in the backyard and stuff. So um once she's finished growing one thing, she'll use the extras or she'll use the uh what do you call it? The byproducts? Like, if you grow beans, you have, like, the husks or whatever that you don't eat. So you can use them as fertilizer to grow the next thing. So then she might grow tomatoes, for example. I don't know. So, that is something that happens in real life. Uh, Winter Warden Boot. Who is the Winter Warden? Is that Winona? Winter Warden. Winter Warden. Blacksmith. No. I don't know. It's someone. <laughs> Alright. The moment you've all been waiting for. Use your noggin. To add up numbers, get to 100 exactly. And a red bird will lay an egg. <laughs> Very nice. Alright. Wish me luck. Ooh, lots of high numbers. Sometimes you get low numbers, sometimes you get high. Hmm. Okay, I got a bit lucky there. I wasn't sure if there would be an 8 ready there. But we took a risk. This is going to be a bit tricky. 15 I can do. It's... Mm, I'm not liking this. I need to somehow get an 11 here. I wanted to leave some options, but it's not letting me take any of them. Uh, very annoying. No, no, no. Come on. Not looking good, guys. <laughs> it's really not looking good. I could, uh, ooh, oh no, it's too late. Okay, I need a, what is three, eight, I need a five. Fuck it now. Yeah, no, this is no good. In fact, I've stuffed that up there too. Honestly, that's just bad luck. Yeah, whatever. Uh, bad luck. <laughs> Bet you won't be the high score. Well, I mean, it takes... Yeah, no. That high score is too damn good. It'll take a lot to beat that. 4 plus 4 plus 3. I don't know. I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I saw some that were two rows over, but you can't make them join sometimes. Anyway, it was good fun. Thank you guys for joining in the stream. I appreciate you taking some time out of your day to hang out with me. It's always a pleasure. I love the chats that we have. So yeah, appreciate it. Thank you, Pison, for the biddies. <laughs> All right, we'll do better next time. <laughs> we'll do better. But yeah. You can't win them all. Uh, who should we go and visit today? Let's see if there's someone who I haven't said hello to in a while. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. 
I will send you over to an orthodox. I feel like it's been a little while. Stop and say hello. Or I grab some lunch. And what is the day today? It's Friday. Um, since I didn't stream yesterday, I was thinking I might do a stream tomorrow. And I never ever stream on Saturday. But for some reason I have tomorrow morning free. I normally go to shops, but I'm not going to do that tomorrow. So I might do a sneaky Saturday stream. I was thinking of playing some Stardew Valley and continuing my world. Just given a little taste of the, what I was, what I'm up to in that world at the moment. So yeah, if you guys want to come back same time tomorrow, I will be there. So yeah, if not, I'm sure I'll see you around in the Discord or back on Twitch next week sometime. So yeah, I'll catch you around. Thank you guys again. I'll see you later.